Hello everybody, and welcome to Hearthstone. So, for those of you who don't know, this is a car online card game based on World of Warcraft. And it's a lot of fun, so let's just get right into let's get right into it. So, every week they have these things called tavern brawls. Where there's a different set of rules. And it makes it more random and it makes it more fun than just the regular games, I think. So in this one, in this tavern brawl, what it is, it's random cards for random costs so you pick your class you pick your yeah you pick your hero and then oh is that frozen nope oh maybe hang on ah, there we go but yeah i'll explain more when we get into the actual game but yeah hearthstone it's probably one of my malfurion versus malfurion one of my main go-tos. I must protect the one. Because it's always pretty Nature fun. must be preserved. Don't want that. Yeah, let's do that. So, in the top left of the card, if my cursor wasn't being so wonky when I tried to record it, I'd be showing you, but in the top left of the card, you see the number in the little crystal type thing? That's the mana cost of the card. So, but in this tavern brawl, Tonight, that changes all the time. Like that, for example. Because that's a four cost car, but he summoned it for one. Just like I can throw this guy down for one. Moger the Ogre. Ah, uh, yeah. By the way, a lot of these cards, like that one I've never seen before. This one, I've seen it a couple of times, but not horribly often. Safety restrictions offline. Oh, God, this is going to be on incredibly one sided. God damn it. I suppose it kind of works out though, because now he can't really, he can't attack me without dying. Uh, but yeah, this game is awesome. So, uh, I haven't been doing a good job of playing anything so far, so these are all legendaries. The ones with like the special looking kind of cards. Answer the call of the lights. Alright, so, battle cries. What battle cries do is when you play down the card, whatever the effect is will happen. So since he played him, he got to add a random paladin card to his hand. Uh, let's discover spell function. Which one of these do I want? I think I'll take Starfire. Hero power, one to the face. And with every, with every hero comes different uh, hero powers. So with uh, Malfurion, the Druid, you get one armor and one attack. God damn it. Okay. Get rid of the one with the effect. So we can draw onto the card. Error 37. Hmm. Oh, well, we'll save that. This probably isn't going to go too well for me. They haven't, typically, of late. Because this is a very RNG heavy kind of game, but it's still a lot of fun. Oh, shit. I kind of wish that he gave a taunt. That would have been easier to deal with because of the Black Knight. Attack two or less. That's not going to help me. That's not going to help me. Uh, let's do that. That's 
pretty decent, actually. We can take him out in one hit, at least. Well, he'll probably just sacrifice this guy. I really want him to give this taunt so that I can just get rid of it. But this is way too RNG heavy. Yeah. Shit. Well, I can at least get rid of one of them. Shit. This is not good. Okay. Uh, Jesus. This isn't gonna turn out well. For the wild. This really isn't gonna turn out well. I'm probably not gonna win this one. Which is a common theme as of late in this game. Ah, it's not too bad to deal with. That's a little worse to deal with. So when your minion is frozen, you can't attack with it. I really need to get rid of that thing. Spell damage plus one, do I have? I need to oh, I'm gonna draw a card because I need to get rid of that thing. Doesn't matter if I have one now. That's not going to help too much either. Uh, what else do I have that I can do? Because this guy's frozen. Ah, uh, shit. Let's discover a spell. Uh, Time waits for no one. Come on, come on, change the cost, change the cost, shit. Wait. Job done. Oh. Holy shit, I might survive another turn. That was pretty clutch, though. Unless he has anything with three more or more attack that has charge. In which case, I'm fucked. Okay, it's not too bad. I'm wondering what in the fuck he is holding Join on to, the though. Pack. Okay. That's not too great. Give a friendly beast plus three health. Take a walk on the Let's wild side. Uh... I don't know what to... I don't know. Let's do you. So you can take out you. Because right now, I need some damage control. For the wild. Okay. I might be back in this. Uh, but we'll see. You still only got to deal four damage to win, so... Yeah, so the entire point of the game is to get the enemy's health down to zero. Okay, that's alright. Oh no, don't fucking have another one of those. Okay, so I can get rid of both. Yes, that's actually pretty good because I'm gonna have to sacrifice a few people. Born to be wild. I'll just do that one because I don't want to give him anything that'll have more than that. And because I have Inspire, I'll get two more attacks. Somehow this is working out for me. I don't know how with how that was going for a bit there, but I 
could just be speaking too soon. He could have just gotten a card that deals fucking five damage and be able to kill me. Nope, not yet. Okay, let's see what I get this time. Yes! This is working out. If he can't summon anything next turn, I win. And this will be a hilarious turn of events, but he might have just gotten another card that can just deal damage, and I'm hoping he didn't. I'm really hoping that both the things he's got are useless. Part of me hopes that he summons a taunt. I can see. Yeah! Holy shit, that was clutch. Alright, I got enough time. Let's do another one. Fuck it. Uh, let's do... I'm feeling... I'm feeling shaman this time. Because, yeah, with different heroes come different hero powers. So, the druids is getting that plus one to... Plus one armor and plus one attack. The shamans is summoning one of four random totems there's one that's does that's a one one card a one one totem that'll deal one damage and has one health another one that heals for one health at the end of your turn Thrall another one that's a taunt Nathurian. and then one that gives you additional spell damage for doomhammer ooh I actually like this hand so far. That's not a bad starting hand. Especially because the costs will randomize. So one of them might turn into a one cost card that I can do right off the bat. Nope. Ah, there we go. Who knows what secrets will uncover? But that's actually pretty great, because then if I summon that guy. Cause yeah, if you can't get rid of him in the first turn. Uh oh. The gates are open. Damn it. Hmm. Let's just do this. And we'll leave it at that for now. So I don't need to get rid of this yet. And I could always do... Can always do something else to mitigate it for the time being, at least. I think this guy might have what left because it doesn't look like he's doing anything. He's not even looking at his cards. You can usually tell because, like, when I fan over my cards, one will pop up and it'll give you. Oh, there we go. He's looking at stuff now. But yeah, you can see that little outline of his one card that he's using. Because people have a bad habit of just leaving, and it's kind of annoying. I like that. So now we'll use that. There we go. It's not a bad start so far. It's too early in the game to call anything. I still don't know how well I'm going to do. And I know you guys can't see my cursor, but I'm fucking with stuff on the map. Like poking the eyes on the top left. Poking the standing eye. The eye stop. Okay, that's not bad. I can mitigate that for now. And that was all his mana. Okay. Let's do that. And I think we'll just leave it at that for now. I'm not going to take that out yet. Now he's going to die when he goes for my taunt. Hopefully I might be able to get another one out next turn. We'll see. Fuck with the griffin. Hmm. 
I don't know if this guy's entirely present for this. He's not looking at any of his cards or anything. What to do? No. Take a walk on the wild side. Okay. Oh, that didn't change. Okay, well. Let's go like this. Let's go like this again. Taunt! Ah, oh, not yet. So. Do not push me. We'll just deal it to the face for now. Yeah, this is the totem that heals people. Only one health at the end of a turn, but it's still something. If it doesn't get rid of this or put down a taunt, it's Bathe over next turn. I think it might be over. Because this is going to get 16 attack next turn. Oh. What does the future hold? I can see. Well. Alright. Two wins in a row. This is unusual for me. Let's go again. Fuck it. Let's go one more. Let's do... Eh, let's go for a priest. So the priest hero power is that you heal two health and you can choose whether you, do, you heal yourself or minions or whatever. And if you get a certain card, I think it's something like Shadow Brand or something like that, is he'll deal damage instead of heal. Which is actually kind of nice every now and then, if that's... Eh, it's not bad, but... I also like having that little two health buffer that you can give yourself. And this will be the last round before I end this one, so hopefully it goes well again. Because if I can get a hat trick, that would be sweet. Because I'm not overly good at this game. I just, I like it. I'm fond of it. It's, there's also a phone app version, which is a lot of fun. If you can get a decent internet connection. Okay. I will fight with honor. The light shall bring victory. Okay. Plus two plus one, spell damage plus one. That's pretty good, especially if I can use that on him. Uh, you know what? I'm good with that. This guy is nice to have as a disable if they put something up with a lot of health but no attack. Because if something has zero health, it dies. So, if that wasn't obvious enough. So, if he puts down like a 0 10 taunt or something like that, I can just throw this down and get rid of it, which is awesome. Villain's chosen. That works well with this because this minion's attack is always equal to its health. So even if this gives it plus two Sometimes plus four, it would really give it things. plus four plus four, which is awesome. Holy Nova. That's not bad, but I don't really want to play that yet. So we'll enter. Don't feel like using my coin. Don't feel like summoning. My Lightwell or my Crazed Alchemist, so I'll just pass on that one. None may steal our secrets. <laughs> okay. That's alright. Yeah, go ahead. Do it. Alright, let's see what I've got. Hmm. Well. Let's do that. And then let's do that. And... That. Because now, when they inevitably go to damage him, it should hopefully... heal him. I'm hoping it'll heal him instead. And spell damage plus one means that my spells will deal more damage, so. I'm hoping this works out and he doesn't just have something that can clear it. 
I wonder. I do too, Uther. Oh, and I'm fighting a ninja turtle. They could at least get rid of the night light well, which wouldn't be bad for them. Oh no, they can get rid of him. The makers. Okay. I can deal with that though. Ah, oh, I can't summon it yet though. Let's just do this. And then we'll do that. Hopefully this will go down so next turn I can play it and just heal it considerably every turn. Okay. Okay, so it doesn't really have to do much, it seems. Aha! Yes, I can put it down. Awesome. Deal two damage to all enemies, restore two to all friendly characters. Let's just do this for now. So, his special thing is he's a taunt, and he can't be targeted by spells or hero powers, which is nice, because there's a lot of spells and hero powers that can just destroy a card or silence it. And when you silence a taunt, it makes it so it's not a taunt anymore. So, let's see what he can do with that, because then I Oh, I can totally give it this. Oh, but I can't use it though, use spells on it either, so never mind, that would just be... Pointless. I bring life. Okay. Reporting for duty. Shit. Really? Okay, well, let's do this. Uh, that. Hmm. No, he doesn't have enough to take it out anyways. But I'll at least make him have to take it out. Back to your homes. Uh, Reporting for duty. This is what I don't like about paladins. They constantly give each other, give their minions divine shields, and that is a bitch to deal with. <clears throat> well, yes. I am Rafa, the supreme archaeologist. Like that one. And then we can yeah. just take that out. Do that just so I can get the attack. That. And there we go. This isn't looking too bad so far. I wonder if this will change cost too. Oh shit. Randomize, randomize, randomize. It did, but it didn't randomize enough. Deal damage to each minion equal to its attack. Shit. Well. Hmm. You love my new recipe. It's gonna do that. That actually, I can deal with that. Huh. I love this game, but my god, sometimes it's real stressful. Reporting for duty. Is he gonna give it a boost? Really? Where do you keep getting these fucking divine shields? Yes. 
that's really good too. But for now, we're just gonna go full OP. Yes. Yes. Oh, come on. Don't push me. Hopefully we can end it next turn. Uh. That would be great. Let's see what he's got. Nope. He doesn't have enough. That's all that he could do. Well played. And we'll just end it. The RNG was in my favor. But yeah, so that's Hearthstone. Uh, this is probably going to be a little bit of a staple for me because I do really like this game and the tavern brawls are really cool and they're different and it's just a different way to enjoy the game as opposed to the regular play. So there'll probably be a few more of these pop up on the channel every now and then too. So thank you everybody for joining me and as always, we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.